Hey, welcome everyone in the interactive session for your career growth. Okay, so this is a personalized session for each and every one of you for your career growth. Okay, so irrespective of any department you come from, whatever the work you are doing currently, you are a student, fresher, or a working professional, this particular session can be one of the best sessions for you all which is totally inclined towards my students career, career growth like how can i help you in, in you know building your career okay so the first uh, point of today's session is data analytics career path for it and non it professionals so most of the students come to me and say that aditi i don't know how i don't know about coding programming python or aditi mujhe kuch bhi nahi aata but let me know the career path, you know, for both if you come from IT or not. this particular session is totally independent of everything. This session is not dependent on any of the past sessions or on the course as well. Okay. So please today learn with a complete open mindset and we're going to cover everything in today's session from scratch. Okay. So if we talk about the domain specific roles, so domain specific jobs can be this. Okay, so let's say if you come from a finance background, you can go for a finance analyst positions. If you come from a marketing background, you can go for a marketing analyst position. If you come from sales background, HR, supply chain, healthcare. So these all are the domain specific job roles for each and every one of you. Okay, so quickly let me know in the chat box that in which domain you want to work with. Let's say if you are from banking background, insurance background, and now you want a career transition, then you can choose any of these particular domains, guys. Shreya, Janardhan, Nikita, Amol, Pooja, Ashish, Piyush, supply chain, financial, e-commerce, HR, banking. Okay. That's amazing. So these all are the domain specific job roles, guys. Okay, so these all are the job roles if you come from an IT or non-IT domain. Okay, but these are the job roles, especially for the people, those who have domain knowledge of this. Okay, if you have a finance domain knowledge, then only go for finance analyst. If you don't have the domain knowledge of any of these domains or any of these profiles, don't apply. Because more than Power BI, you need to know about that particular business, fine? So domain knowledge is very, very important, okay? Aarti is saying, but Aditi, I have total 11 plus years of experience in finance background. Then finance analyst designation doesn't suit. Aarti, for finance, we have a lot of profiles for experienced candidate as well. So Aarti, you can try for the finance analyst, no problem. Okay, Yamini, Pratik Shine here. So make sure, guys, that if you all want to go in a domain-specific role, for that, you need to at least choose your domain and you need to understand that domain in a far better way, okay? So I want to suggest each and every one of you in here, you don't need to be influenced by others. You don't need to be influenced from anybody out there. Like, if this person is doing this, I will also go to doing this. No, no. For all these particular domain roles is only for the people, those who have an experience in the same domain. If you come from a zero experience background, then these are the other profiles for you. Okay. So if you don't have any knowledge about any of the domain, any of the department, then these all are the other profiles for you. Okay, but if you have the domain knowledge, if you have experience in domain and now you are looking forward for an analyst position, then these all are the positions for you. Okay, Nikita, Munishwar, Prakash, Chitra, Akanksha, Jyoti, Mohammed, Taniksha, Binod. See it very, very carefully. Yes, Anusha. So make sure that you go for, you know, either domain specific do you don't need to confuse yourself okay domain specific role is only for the experienced candidate okay but other profiles are only for those who are come from uh we can say you know fully fresher background okay those who don't have any sort of knowledge is it clear everybody 
with the job roles where you want to go okay because after learning power bi as well if you have not decided your goal it will be difficult for you to get into this industry because guys personally nowadays i will give you a complete scenario okay and i'll be completely transparent with you nowadays you know companies are there are thousands of power bi developers there is there is not only one to two developers out there there are many people who know power bi okay but if thousand people will know power bi only 100 knows how to relate it with business how to grow business using power bi how to analyze data effectively how to do storytelling using power bi how to be more confident with power bi how to do forecastings and predictions with power bi okay so there are thousands of power bi developers out there but there is only few who can help company to grow through power bi okay so if you want to help company to grow for that you need to have a proper domain knowledge of that company or of that project or of that client that's why domain knowledge is very important so everyone for everyone in here don't only focus on creating visualization creating reports creating dashboards doing thousands of projects doing same 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 task in every project there is no point of it if you are using same bar chart donut chart pie chart in 10 number of your projects it will not help you okay so make sure from today you focus on getting a domain knowledge as well for an example if you are doing a project of netflix you have a netflix data and you are creating dashboard for netflix then try to understand their business okay and then create report in such a way so that after seeing your report i can take some business decisions for netflix to grow okay so you don't need to create report and dashboard only just to convert tabular data into meaningful dashboard you need to create report to to you know improve and and, and, and enhance the company okay so you need to grow the company using analyzation of the data and for creating reports and dashboards quickly write yes in a chat box if it's clear for you Okay, I don't want you to be same. I don't want you to be the same like a thousands of Power BI developers out there. I want you to be very different and different in which prospect? Different in a prospect where you got a domain knowledge, where you get a domain knowledge, okay, where you can genuinely help any company to grow. Is it clear, everybody?